Hello, writers. It is time to do some writing together. And we know that summer is right around the corner. So I have some summer writing prompts for you. So let's get writing. Here is the writing prompt for today. The question is, should you have homework in the summer? I want you to think about that question. Should you have to do homework over the summer or do you think that you need a break? What do you think? Think about that. Hmm. And we are going to write about that together. So I want you to get out a piece of paper or a notebook, a pencil or a marker, and we are going to write the answer to that question. Now there is no right answer. This is an opinion, and that means you're just going to tell me what you think. Maybe you think we should have homework. Maybe you think we should not have homework. And I'll tell you what I think. Okay, so let's get out that paper, and I'll do the same. Okay, here's my writing paper, and I have my pencil. I'm ready to go. And you can always pause the video if you need time. Okay. So we're all going to start the sentence in the same way. We're going to start by saying, in the summer, we should, and then you're going to write what you think. So let me show you how to do that. We're going to start with a capital I for the word in. Leave a space, of course, between our words. Write the word the, that's a sight word, T-H-E, and the word summer, okay, S-U-M-M. -M. E R. There it is. Now, when we start a sentence with a phrase like this, in the summer, we need to put a comma. That's a little line after the after the letter. So please add that little comma in. In the summer, we should. Okay, so let's write we W E a little space and the word should. Now should is a tricky word. We can figure out the first the first two letters because the first two letters make this sound. Shh. What two letters make that sound? S, H, good. Should. It does not sound, it's not written the way it sounds. It's written like this, O, U, and then there's a silent L. You can't hear that L. But you can hear the last sound in the word should. Should. There's the D. Okay. In the summer, we should. Now I'm going to stop there because this is where you are going to write what you think. If you think that we should not have homework, then you're going to write, we should not have homework and you need this word not right here if you feel that we should have homework then you are not going to write the word not you are just going to write we should have homework so i want you to think for a minute what if we should have homework or should not have homework write your sentence and then you can, you can pause it if you need a minute to catch up because then we're going to write something very important. We're going to write why, why you feel that way. And we're going to use the word because. So go ahead, pause it, write the sentence, and then press play when you're ready. Okay, so you should have the, the first sentence done. Now, I'm going to tell you what I think. I'm a teacher and I know how important it is to keep those minds sharp and keep your brains working. So I think we should have some homework. But I only think that you should have a little bit of homework over the summer, not a lot. That's what I'm going to write on my paper. If you want to write, we should not have homework, that is okay. You can write whatever you think. This is your writing. And you're not wrong if you think that. You should write whatever you believe. Okay, so let me tell you the next part. Uh, oh, Mrs. Savage, you made a mistake. 
I put a period here and I should not have put a period. I'm going to erase that because we are actually not done. Now we are going to write why we feel that way. Okay, so uh, let me just go back and reread. In the summer, we should have homework because, and that's the word that you need to write after you write if you should have it or not. Because, there's the word because, B-E-C-A-U-S-E. -E. Okay, we should have homework because, Okay, so now you have to write why you think that we should have homework or not. If you don't think we should have homework, please tell me why. Maybe you think it's because your brain needs a rest. Maybe it's because you want to have a lot of fun outside. Maybe it's because you don't like homework. Whatever the reason is, I want you to write that down. I'm going to tell you why I think that we should have homework. I think we should have homework because it is fun. I like homework. It's fun to do homework, it's fun to read, and it's fun to write. So that's why I think we should have homework. It's okay if you don't agree with me, but that's what I'm going to write. Okay, so let me get my pencil back. All right, and I'm going to choose orange because this is my own thinking. Because it, 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 it is fun, fun, there's the word fun, F-U-N, fun, and I have another reason too. So I'm going to write the word and, it is fun and, mm, let's see, what should I write? It is fun and it keeps me thinking that's what i'm going to write it it keeps k -k 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 keep keep keeps me that's a sight word thinking th starts the word thinking th -ing. think ing Whenever we hear the sound ing at the end of the word, there's three letters that make that sound. It's I-N-G. Okay, it is fun and it keeps me thinking. Boys and girls, sometimes we can end our sentence with a period. Most times we end with a period. But we can also end our sentences with an exclamation point. And an exclamation point tells us that we're excited to write what we're writing. So let me go back and reread my uh, sentence to you. In the summer, we should have homework because it is fun and it keeps me thinking. Now, remember, you're not writing what I wrote. I want you to write your own reason why we should have homework or should not have homework. Whatever you decide, I want you to keep reading with your family and keep thinking, whether it's outside or inside. Keep those brains sharp, and we'll see you in first grade. Great job, boys and girls.